space yeah. is what we'd hope It's really to fun. It's really fun. I, I'm still in the tutorial phase. The I've been playing it for about Minus three and a half hours okay. now, I think. So, okay. yeah. That's a it's big still mess. adding things in. I think we can all be proud of what we've accomplished here. No, but, fair enough, Moist. Fair enough. But what? I can hear it yeah, in I like my management okay, sims, so okay. this comes under that category. I'm just wondering what Dua is really up to. I don't buy all her saving the future by controlling the past talk. You got any games you're playing at the moment, Moist, yeah, you'd recommend? Yeah, mentioned that some of the animals are being moved to an undisclosed location. He wouldn't say, or maybe he didn't know who was taking delivery, but it wasn't the DFW. Third party? You and I are not invited. Alright, well that's another level done, guys. Oh, okay, Moist. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fair enough. Uh, there are reports of contested airspace. Okay, cool. Okay, let's see what happens here. The first reports were from Seattle Tacoma Airport's air So it looks control. like this is but gonna be our first glimpse at airborne dinosaurs. So they are traveling south. That would be my guess, looking at all the pterodons. The weather. Agreed. They're migrating. But no, this is so pretty! What happens if one of these animals decides to play chicken with a commercial airliner? This is the modern world and the prehistoric one on a collision course. Right, okay, let's see what we have to do. So we need an Avery, Avery Hatchery, and an Expedition Center. Okay, cool, that makes sense. If Owen and Lambert do what they say they can, we're going to need facilities in place for the flyers when they arrive. Let's start with some Avery domes and a hatchery. Oh, we also need an Expedition Center. And as you heard, Time is not on our side. Right, Expedition Center. Oh. Okay, so they're basically big, long. Uh, needs a hatchery. Okay, cool. Okay, that makes sense. Right, okay. So we'll deal with that in a second. Let's get the, the essential bit in. Right. So we need an Avery. I'm going to put a nice long path um, this way. Right, so let's build our first Avery. Uh, oh, I've got to research it. Okay. Uh, cheaper research and... Sure. Right, let's do that. Okay, so we need to get the research. Okay, and then that should put us in the right position for this. Right, we'll just let the um, time spin on. So we can get our research done. And then we'll plop off first enclosure down hopefully and we'll see how it goes we'll just see how it goes cool okay so that's now researched ah stream raiders right let's do that first uh anyone get a store for one item they <laughs> yeah they always get you like that they always get you like that that is very much the way Right, so we've now got our Avery. Uh, oops. Uh, I need to spin it around. Oh, crumbs. Okay, so I have to put the Avery down first. Oh my god, it's huge. Okay. Wow. Okay, I was. I mean, it needs to be pretty big, so that makes sense. Uh, didn't quite expect it to be that. I don't know why I thought it was going to be small. That's just silly. Um. Okay. Um, so yeah, that's the thing. Right, so we're going to let that build up. Okay, that takes a while, but we are there. Cool, so I assume we're going to have to expand this somewhat. Ready on this end. We could send out expeditions for remote capture. These creatures can okay. cover a lot of ground from the air, so we should snap to it. 
right, let's fly the not so friendly skies. Oh, here we go. Instant alert. Yes, please. Oakland. Pteranodons. Awesome. I only need two expertise, so let's go with that. We're gonna go with that. Um, right. I where is flyers ready to deliver? Have them brought to the aviary hatchery by our transport team. We'll then release them into the dome. And by release, you mean contain? I don't have a ranger team. In a controlled environment and under our supervision and care. Excellent. Yeah, I don't. I don't have a ranger team. Okay, we need to sort that. We most definitely need to sort that out. Because that will end badly. Um, let's put the rangers right outside because that's probably the most sensible spot for them. Um, so yeah, we're gonna get some pterodons. Let's see how this goes. Um. I wonder if I'm going to get much control over what goes on inside the dome. So we got five pteranodons found, and we managed to get all five. So... How are they going to stick them in there? Does the roof open? Oh, they go in there! Oh, okay, that makes sense. Okay. Okay, and then they close the hatch and then release it. Yeah, okay, that makes sense. I imagine this is going to get a bit cramped. But okay, that makes sense. Okay, so they're going to let them loose in there. I may need to expand this though. This seems a little bit cruel. Just have a tiny little... That's kind of cute though. It's adorable. I can... Yeah! <laughs> Okay, so we need to obviously attend to their needs. They're a little bit lonely, but that should sort itself. So we need waters, rocks. Okay, they don't have enough open space, so we definitely have to expand it. We definitely need to expand it. Um, okay, so... Ah, oh, so it snaps on. Okay. Okay, I've probably not put this in the best configuration. Okay, the too close to a dinosaur thing is going to get really annoying really fast. Like we might be getting things under control. Okay, yeah, let's get the feeder down first. Uh, feeder. Oh, crumbs. I need water for that. Okay, right. Let's do terrain constraints. Why are you contacting us? Same thing as always. The dinosaurs. Okay, right. There we go. Not much, but it'll do the job. Good to hear from you again, Dr. Malcolm. Okay, that's not uh, enough water. Ah, that's now, annoying. The, uh, okay. Intelligence part of the CIA, if I'm to uh, understand mm. We do what we can. Okay. Yes. Yes. We do what we can. Can I... Is that going to be enough? Is that enough now? Interesting times. And I mean times as the dinosaurs are living in ours. Should they be here? Yeah, no. it doesn't like that. Are okay. Yes. Right, yeah, I need Ergo, to find a way to expand this. Should. Let's go. The hand of chaos is revealed. It's what else remains hidden that's concerning me at the moment, Doctor. Oh, yes, indeed. Yes, this is annoying yes, about the whole too I close to dinosaur thing. To help shed some light in this regard, Mr. Right. Okay, let's, let's do that. Uh, Hopefully, of, uh, this will be sufficient space. Then I can expand uh, the water so I can put the feeder down. Because without that, I've got a huge problem here. These dinosaurs require feeders if they're to stay healthy. Right. Okay. Cool. Stay on top of it. Right. Okay. Well, now I've got more space to work with. Right. Okay. Hopefully, I can now actually get the feeder in. Right. Yeah, now I can. Okay, brilliant. Right, so we've got a feeder down. Right, let's do an assessment and find out what else they want. Uh, so they need rocks. They've got a lot more space now. So yeah, it's, it's literally just rocks. Okay. Hey, I'm Isaac Fleming. Dr. Malcolm should have mentioned me earlier. We have some specific requirements, including a ranger team to gather information and monitor the animals within the aviary. 
A viewing gallery right. is also on our list. So uh, Okay, that's enough rocks. Cool, perfect. Okay, nice. Right. Uh they want a viewing gallery. Avery viewing gallery. I'm gonna go with that. I think that is the most sensible location for it, personally. Right, I'm gonna do that. Right. Um, I also need to assign a ranger team to the hatchery so they can keep an eye on my little birdie birds. There we go, they're just quietly munching away. There we go. That's it, good little pterodons. Good little pterodons. Right, so we're gonna... I wonder if that's... Yeah, that's sufficient coverage. Okay, brilliant. Cool. Okay, so we're gonna leave that to do its thing. Nearly there, and then we'll see what else it wants us to do. Perfect. Right. I'm sure they have 90% comfort. I'm We've already got that ready. So we're good on that front, so we've just gotta wait no, for the timer. Seriously. Why the fly? Uh, okay, I'm not following you. Dr. Malcolm starts contacting Dr. Dua from who knows where, and he's flying right, reptiles. come on, 40 seconds. Why? Go, 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 go. Because they introduce a unique danger, and he's concerned. Yeah, that's, that's probably right. <laughs> Let's not get ahead of ourselves, Ellen. For now, we should make sure the satisfaction but, level for the flyers is high. That's verifiable data we can use. Forget the conspiracy angle. All right. Okay, so let's have a look for more incidences. So, so there's what is it? Pterodons, Trophonagathus, and Dimorphodon. I think we'll go with more pterodons to start with because we can use the one we have right now. The facility is functioning as anticipated. We have enough that will just be pipeline that we should be able to move that'll just be soon. quick and easy uh right now, let's build another avery could engulf the world your concern is noted for now i suggest we focus on this location it's about high welfare and visibility for the animal i'm gonna build and one there for the dfw staff of course and then we'll put the avery hatchery yeah, there with the dinosaurs is a process we're getting there Okay, cool. So that'll build another one out. One thing is I can put something big in here. Born of our arrogance, humanity versus the dinosaurs. And honestly, I'm not sure who yeah. deserves to win. I can't. Hmm. I kind of built myself into a corner a little bit with this one. That should be suitable for something, though. Even if I just put, like, the Dimorphodons in there. Um, edge of the map. I can probably get another big Avery in here. If we want to find success, we must look to the sky. That means more flyers and more species of flyers in the aviaries. Flap, not fluff, huh? 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 <laughs> <sighs> I want to get a bit more in here, and I can't because I can't change the. Okay, that's a little finickety. It's another Avery, though, so it'll do the job. Right, cool. Okay, so three out of four. Um, yeah, let's bung them in there. Right. Uh, let's put another hatchery in there. Okay, cool. So we've got some extra. We need power. Uh, let's go... Put that there. Uh, this needs resupplying as well before we forget. Right, so that'll be another job job. I'm going to need more ranger teams, aren't I? Uh, let's add some more response facilities. Uh, just so we can keep an eye on things. Okay, so that's the second team coming in. 
Now, are these gonna need more space? I hope they don't. I wonder how many pterodons are happy living with each other before they start getting mad. Hopefully I get a reasonable number of them in before they go absolutely crazy at each other. Right, okay, so they're all delivered now. Are you happy or are you gonna... Okay, they need more open space apparently. So yeah, we need to expand this. Let's go let's grab another dome. So that should give them plenty of um, space to roam around in. I'm going to try and build up to the wall as much as I can. I'm hoping we can get an absolutely redonkulous uh, flock of pterodons. That'd be really cool. Um... Okay, so we need more... We need more fish and we need more rocks. Okay, let's solve that for them. So, we're going to put another feeder in... Okay, we're going to have to make a bigger area of water as well. Right, let's... Where is it? Let's go with that. Okay, and then... Feeder... There we go. And then they want more rocks, so... I'm going to try and space these out a little bit. Hey, Minnie, how you doing? Everything all spiffy? Hope you're doing well. There we go. Right. Okay, are my pterodons happy now? They all look pretty content. <laughs> yeah! Yep, they look happy. Okay, that's cool. Just chilling out the top. Isn't that pretty? Isn't that pretty? Just all chilling, hanging out. You'd be like, mm, there's nommy stuff in the box we can chew on. Um But yeah, cool. So we've got uh got all that sorted out. Right. I am gonna assign to that one, because we've got the other Hang on, did they... Oh, hang on, no, 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 I need to go to the map. Hang on, uh, not that one. Um, need to go world map. Oh, hugs, mini. Hugs. Right, let's get the Dimorphodon. Let's get the Dimorphodon. I'm going to need another team as well because we're going to need one for the other one. I need to really expand the buildings, but we'll do that later when we get a chance. Right. Okay, so we'll plop that down there. I need to research more stuff. Let me go to the uh, research panel a second. Let me try and get some more structures and stuff. Um, Yeah, let's do that. I really want to try and get as much of this research as I can, because the sooner I have it, the better. Um, I also need to get more bits and bobs for me. Enclosures, because that will also help out quite nicely. Right, something has low health. Why, why does one of my animals have low health? Let's have a look. Hi, what's up with you? Why do you have low health? Food, you lack food. Okay, why are you lacking food? There is literally fish things all over the place. Why can't you find food? It's literally behind you. Um... I mean, there's fish in there. It's not like it's short. I mean, these guys can find it. 
I I don't understand why he's struggling to find the feeder. Is he just having a hard time competing with his friends, maybe? I don't know. Let's put some more water down. They want steak. Yeah, yeah, sure. Yeah, we all want steak. Okay, I may need to bin these rocks so that I can put another feeder down. I will fix it. Uh, let's... I can only guess they're competing for the feeder. So I'm just gonna try and sort this as best as I can. Uh, let's, yeah, let's transport these. Uh, right, I want the Dimorphodons to go in here. Right, let's try and fix this, come on. Why can you still not find a feeder? There literally are feeders all over the place. I don't get it. I don't get it. They're being fussy. Oh well, if he can't use his common sense to find the feeder, that's his problem, not mine. <laughs> I've done all I can at this stage. I've literally done all I can for that uh, for that pterodon. If he can't figure it out, it's literally right there. Is it because he's hit zero stamina? He can't move. I can only guess that's the issue. Have I got medical crew somewhere maybe that can help? I don't think I have a medical crew. Hang on, we might need to do that. Uh... Let's put one of those down. Yeah, I'm not too confident what to do with this. I think he might... Yeah, this this pterodon is going to die. I mean, he's slightly moving around, but he's got no stamina. Yeah, not bad. I, I just... I have a bit of a mystery at the moment. I've got a pterodon that won't move and won't eat. And I've done all I can, really, to try and... try and help it out although he is resting now so maybe if he gets a little bit of stamina back yeah he's got some stuff okay hopefully it'll go feed now all right we are just getting some dimorphodons but yeah we're into flying dinos now Taylor. i think this is section what four or five of the story so far so we're just learning how to wrangle some uh, little birdie birds so they need water and sand and fish so let's start by converting the land to sand uh where is it it's that one isn't it yeah 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 it's the, the, the first one is interesting. There's a lot of good things about it. There's a few little things that annoyed me. But it is pretty good. I do recommend it. I'm not sure how much it is at the moment, price-wise. Uh, might be worth looking on GMG. I've got a link for them. I've got like an affiliate code. I do get benefit from it, full disclosure. But um, they, they have good deals on there. You might be able to get a good deal. So that might be worth checking out if you want to maybe get the uh, other one. You might be able to nab yourself a good deal on it. Um, oh, you got it. Oh, okay, good. Awesome. That's nice. 
So, mission, missing... Okay, so they just need fish. Cool, so let's put... Okay, so I've, if anything, I kind of overkilled it with how big that is. Yeah, no, that's fair enough. You never know, Black Friday or Christmas, they might do a sale. I don't know. But, um, yeah, there's a possibility. Right, uh, one of my scientists is overworked, so we need to go to the staff center. View scientists, give her a rest. And then I need to do some research, because we need to keep progressing with that. So let's keep having a look at structures. So, uh, right, at the moment... Ooh, hang on. Okay, I need more scientists, but they're busy. Okay, cool. <laughs> yeah, I do too. I like getting a game on sale. Especially if it's one I'm not, like, sure about. Just uh, a bit of a safer bet that way. But, um, yeah, so far this is good. There's a few little minor things, but it's good improvement so far but as I say I'm still just in the tutorial right now I've still got this weird issue with this dino refusing to eat dude there is literally food is he now glitched on the I think this pterodon is just doomed to die I don't think there's anything I can do about this <laughs> god dang it I try and feed it I, it's, no. It's just not cooperating. Okay, three out of four. That's not bad. Right, um... Let's stick him in this dome. Yeah, Game Pass. I've, I've never used it personally. I do, I do know a lot of people that do have Game Pass and really enjoy it and really like it. Hey, Pixel Perfect. Thank you so much for joining us today. I hope you're doing well. Hope all this spiffy... Uh, I... Where's my medical team? Hang on. Um, there they are. I really want them to fix this pterodon. I wonder if having another viewing area might help. Then they're not all, like, clumped up in that one area. Like that, maybe? I'm hoping that will help. I don't know if it will at this stage, but I, I want to try. Right, I'll put some power down there. Uh, do titles nice Yeah, no, fair enough. Yeah, I was saying my bro my brother has it, and I actually know some other people as well that have it, and they do recommend. What the hell is going on here? Okay, that tyrannid. Okay, that's weird. Okay, we have a tyrannid. <laughs> what the hell? Okay, I think it thinks it's on the feeder. I think that's what is going on. And there's another... Have they all just freaked out because I put the other viewing zone down? Is that what it is? I mean, at least some of them are kind of occupying down the bottom here now. Why are they starving? There's no reason to starve. There's literally fish everywhere. Okay, I'm just gonna let them do their thing. If they starve, I... As I said, I've done the best I can. Right, let's get these assets in. Let's get these new, um, birdie thingies in. Um, right, how big are these big boys? I think these ones are the big ones. Da 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 da. <laughs> okay, so. Oh my god, he's got a huge beak. Holy moly. Okay. Water. Oh, he needs forest. Okay. Yeah, so we need we need a load of water. We need some forest. Um, sure. All right, let's try and do this. Okay. Uh, let's put the feeders in. 
and then forest. I wonder if that's going to be enough, though. Uh, are you happy? Yeah, that's plenty of forest for you. You've got open space. You've got plenty of area to roam. Okay, cool. So they're all happy sausages. Cool. So all the uh, floaty boaty birdy thingies are happy. Um, although some seem to be more happy than others. So you're 100% perfect. Right. Who is not 100% happy? It's got to be the Dimorphodons then. What are you boys missing? No, you're happy. Okay, so what the hell is wrong then? I'm confused. Why are they not happy then? Uh... Yeah, so their territory needs are all good. Oh, it's not going to be that one that's ill, is it? I swear, if it's screwing up my stats. Oh, I hope it's not screwing with it. Right, they're all listing as... Okay, oh no, the timer is going down. Okay, good. I was worried. I thought it wasn't. I lost track, but it is going down. Okay, we're good. Oh, that's that mission done. Nice. There we go. Fish bash bosh. Yeah. Okay, cool.